Hey, hello, welcome. So my name is Tolisha Du Francis and so I'm here again and today I want to talk about habits. So what does the word habit mean? So habit, the word habit is gotten from the Latin word habitus. Habitus H A B I T U S which means condition. Okay, which means condition or appearance. Now every habit is a function of our condition, our state of mind, our thoughts and it's reflective in the way we do those things that we do. Okay, and I'm very sure that nobody wants his or her life to be weighed down by the appearance of any habit whatsoever. Everybody wants to live in a way that you are up there in everything that you do, all right? And when these habits show up, they have a way of weighing us down. Now I am talking about negative habits. I'm not talking about positive habits, I'm talking about negative habits. Whenever they show up, they have a way of weighing us down and hindering us from achieving what we really 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 want to achieve okay now the bad thing or, or the, the sad thing about bad habits or negative habits is the fact that it's a reflection of who we are i mean it's a condition that we are in we want to but we cannot i don't even know what i'm trying to say like you really want to break that habit you really want to put an end to that condition but you seem limited or you seem powerless to changing that thing. That is what every habit does. So if you have a positive habit, okay, it's a, it's a condition that you are in, all right? And if anybody tells you to stop, you ask questions of why should I stop? Okay, so when you have a negative habit or a bad habit, it's the same thing. You know that you have this condition. Even if you don't know, some people would have told you, you are fond of doing this, you are fond of doing this, you are fond of doing this, all right? So that condition is there, but you're powerless to changing that condition. And that is where the stigma or that is where the stronghold is. So for you to be able to break off any habit, you must first of all understand that there's a need for you to change your mind. There's a need for you to change your thoughts. There's a need for you to change your condition. Sometimes you may not be able to do this alone. Okay, you may not be able to do this on your own. It might require the help of a professional, uh, a therapist or a counselor, right? Do not hesitate to seek one. The bad thing about habits, like I said earlier, negative habits, is that they weigh you down. So I challenge you today to get out there and ensure that every condition that you are in that is hindering your growth, hindering your movement, hindering your progress, either upward or forward, needs to be dealt with. Seek that help that you need to seek today before it's too late. So I come your way again. Bye.